come to the special feature of our program, the presentation of our mystery celebrity. My friends on the panel would recognize our guest immediately, so they have been provided with blindfolds. Are they all in place, panel? Yes, yes. sir. Good. Will you come in, mystery challenger, and sign in, please? panel, as you know, in the case of our mystery celebrity, we get right down to the general questioning, which we will begin with Dorothy Gilgallum. Uh, are you in any phase of the entertainment business? Yes. <laughs> uh, have you ever appeared in motion pictures? Have you ever appeared in motion pictures? Yes. <laughs> uh, have you also appeared in television before tonight? Yes. <laughs> and I suppose you also have been on the radio. I beg your pardon, Mr. Gilgallan? Uh, has he also been on the radio, I wanted to know? <laughs> I'm awfully sorry, uh, Dorothy, that we didn't get the question. I wanted to know if he'd ever been on the radio. <laughs> yes, <Yeah>, sure. <laughs> Uh, are you uh, an active performer? Yeah. <laughs> Would you call yourself an actor? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Have you ever played a leading man? <laughs> A more sinister character than a juvenile. A more sinister character than a juvenile? Mm -hmm. Yes, sure. <laughs> Are you under 48? <laughs> primarily a comedian, despite what you are evidently doing now. No. That's one down. Nine to go, Mr. Sir. I, I want to make sure, uh, Dorothy, of, of the sex of this person. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm not convinced that, you're, that this is a man. I'm going to take... Go ahead. Uh, this could be anything. Are you... <laughs> uh, I, I'll dispose of this very quickly. Are you, by any chance, a female? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, laughter. Oh. Uh, you're an actress, in other words, and not an actor. Is that correct? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, the voice that you are, uh, the voice that you are using is a far, far cry, I take it, from your normal dulcet tones. Is you that correct? Said it. <laughs> Would you uh, describe yourself, or would you allow John to describe you as a very attractive actress? Yes, sir. Uh, a star, in other words. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Are you, or have you ever been, a uh, brunette? <laughs> Are you a brunette now? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I think I recognize this lady's voice. Well, go, Bennett. Are you, uh, <laughs> are you married? Yeah. Is, <laughs> is your husband also known in, uh, in the entertainment world? Yeah. Would you say that your husband was primarily a singer? No. <laughs> Go. We have about three and a half minutes to go, Miss Francis. Uh, 
Are you primarily known for your picture work? Yes. <laughs> and you are considered a leading lady star, is that correct? Also. <laughs> and you are considered a comedian? Yes. And uh, have you a picture playing at the present time on Broadway? No. Three down and seven to go, Mr. Allen. Well, let's see. <laughs> Have you had your throat checked lately? <laughs> oh, I withdraw that question. Uh, we've established that you are married. Do you ordinarily make your home in Hollywood? Yes. Yeah. I see. Are you a blonde? No. That's four down and six to go. That have makes uh, Miss Kilgallen next. Have you any children? Yes. Yeah. Have you had one within the last year? No. <laughs> Five down and five to go. We have about two and a half minutes to go. Better serve. I, are you preparing to go into a Broadway show? Yeah. Well, I, 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 I'm gonna, may I take a stab at this, John? Are you Rosalind Russell? Rosalind Russell. Your husband a singer? A singer, not Dorothy, that 48. <laughs> <laughs> but darling, I didn't have you in mind. <laughs> well, actually, Bennett, you raised a very interesting question. Uh, I think all of us know that uh, Miss Russell has made a picture recently about the Women's Army Corps. But uh, I think probably Bennett even, ha even has to jump on me. What did bring you to New York? Oh, well, actually, I came to do the musical version of My Sister Eileen, which is now called Wonderful Town. And this is true. That's what's happening to my voice from overwork and rehearsing. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually what we decided we would use that one. It's great fun doing this musical. If you don't help your voice, I'll call it my brother. <laughs> <laughs> I love Dorothy thinking I was the man. Yes, and I also came here too to work and exploit on our picture, Never Wave It a Whack, which is going to open in Washington at a big premiere there, which the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the Army are going to help sponsor in, on the 28th of January. Wonderful. So I hope to be able to get away and get to that as well. Well, I'm sure the Wax have never had so lovely or so able a representative. Well, thank In you. In movies or out. And well. may I offer our all of our thanks, because you've come and joined us tonight. It's been a lot of fun. I enjoyed may it I ask very much. Russell, thank one you. question, Don. Isn't your husband sometimes known as a singer? That's my father-in-law, Carl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you were on the right track. No, my poor husband can't sing the scale. I'm married to his son, Carl Brisson's son, Freddie Brisson. Ah, but you were on the right track. That's very good. <laughs> Perhaps you should cut a minute of it off for us. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I enjoyed it. Good night.